everybody, this is Roxy, and I'm making some cards for a challenge over on your paper pantry that I'm hosting. Um, we're going to have a different design team member do each month. Um, so this month was mine. And this is my card. The, um, my challenge was to do a sympathy card with bright colors. And this is what I came up with. This stamp set is, I just found it last month or two months ago. It's called Roses in Winter. And the person I bought it from included an extra, two extra stamps. Otherwise, you get these two sentiments, the branch, and then, <coughs> excuse me, they call it two-step process, but actually three steps. So you get these two. Where's the other little one? Oh, this one. So that's one, the one rose. And then you get a leaf. You know, so you just go and then a little tiny like bloom. So I'm using those and then my sentiment is from Paper Smooches, and that set is this great set. It is called Sentiment Sampler. So this is like the one stamp set you need for your cards. Um, and then I'm using Picked Raspberry, Peeled Paint, and Scattered Straw for my flowers and leaf and whatever. <laughs> Excuse me, I tried other colors, like some of my Heidi Swap colors, and I just didn't like them, and I really love that pickled raspberry. So, here we go. It's super simple. For the first largest rose, I'm just going to stamp off to get a lighter color. And you just want to make sure that everything is, um, you know, they have these labels or whatever. So everything is lined up. If you turn it, you know which I want to turn it, just turn the other two stamps too. And I'm just using, um, the white paper I'm using is just, you know, the, the paper packs from Michael's that are like, I think, four for ten dollars this week. And, okay, then I'm going to turn this one. Excuse me, I think I'm going to turn it like that and stamp off one for the side flowers. Oops, I didn't stamp off. Well, gives it a little bit difference. Excuse me, I have a dry throat. It is just freezing cold up here these last couple of few days. It was eight below this morning, so not pretty. I think I just used this, yeah.
<laughs> that's good. And then my sentiment. Right then, I have this little corner adorner. These are still available online. Uh, try eBay if you like these or like this look. They're kind of fun to add a little softness to your card if you don't want to do a lot of embellishing. And guess what? I don't want to do a lot of embellishing today. The group or the challenge we're doing is three cards all right um, so then I just turned it around to do the other corners okay so this just gets tucked in Just for a little bit of something, something, <clears throat> I just cut a piece of the doily. Tucked it in the top corner. A little bit of glue. Well, I can't believe David Bowie passed away. I'm so bummed. He was like, he's like our favorite artist of all time. Went to a few of his concerts when he was here. He was a brilliant artist. Very one of a kind. <clears throat> Excuse me. I never had heard that he was sick. Just want to make sure it's all straight. It's not straight. I'll probably put uh, glossy accents under that. But there's my card. So I just need to make one more. But the oh, so the whole idea of the challenge it's kind of like Linda's Christmas challenge where she's making five Christmas cards every month and then by the time Christmas comes you've got 60 cards so my idea was to do the same only with greeting cards so every month we're gonna have a different theme card uh, with this different kind of sentiment or different um, yeah sentiment <laughs> So it'll be birthday, get well, whatever. And we make three cards, so we'll have um, cards on hand and in our stash when we need them. This is not going to be a swap. It's just a um, way to kind of challenge yourself and really get some things done and have cards on hand. So come and join us at yourpaperpantry.ning.com. It's only $12 a month for swapping, and we have a lot of fun. A lot of people make really good friends, and um, we support each other in our art and in our life. So, thanks for watching. Bye. I'm loving you on air.